ApeCoin has been reviving as, as a search term. Not only that, during the huge crash that we are seeing in the last few hours, ApeCoin has managed to pull through a lot better than other tokens. And as we said, as I do, we discussed early in the morning, because a lot of you were wondering, will we break 10.5? Host, this is the area where wells are buying. I told you a few times. Uh, we'll talk about that also. Um, ApeCoin mentions going up a little bit. According sentiment is 100% according to Ape Wisdom. Uh, and something interesting is that from the wallets of the top uh, 100 Ethereum wallets on um, most traded token, there is actually Ape. That's the that's the most important thing you should know. And Ape is right under. USDT, USDC, after that it's a basically the most important token. Like there's nothing more important than that. Which also reminds me that I should record about Spell uh, as well. But it's very late. I'm very tired. It's been uh, quite a ride today. We have recorded a lot of videos. But I just want to fill you up with what's going on with Ape. So again, for the price, uh, I do believe 11.7 is in the crosshairs. This is a very doable price point that we can achieve i do believe we can get to um uh here the question is if we pump here and break the uh 12.30 dollar uh, area we're definitely due due for uh, a, a another run and this is what we need this will be a confirmation above the 21 ema which is the um the this area right here Something positive is that VWAP is still curving up, as you can see here. That's an important signal, especially for the short term. Uh, it depends on when you're seeing this video. VWAP on the three hour chart curving up as well. That's also a very, very good sign. Uh, another thing that I want to point out was uh, for, I don't know if it's a troll. Let's start with this. Uh, I've, I've seen a few people talk about it so actually upvote both of these guys because they deserve uh recognition for bringing this up let me show this username so we can thank him uh hello indeed there are plans to support this token however we do not have an eta yet so uh there's uh there's the possibility that soon ledger will support a that's very very obvious that it will happen at one point because it's basically the top coin outside of tether in usdc uh, by well, top well, so a lot of people hold a lot of ape, and you want you would want to have it on a cold storage. So that's really really good um, that we have that. Something weird that I've seen uh, is this trilogy: Ape Coin X Coinbase Board Ape is getting a film trilogy. What? I would not be surprised because of Board Apes, but uh, what? We're getting a movie. Getting their own film trilogy. ApeCoin. Uh, what? Ape film trilogy. What? This is insane. This is insane. We have a lot of news uh, for this video. And none of them are clickbait. This is going to be huge. It's from Coindesk. How did I miss that? This has been such a long day for me i'm sorry but i'm doing this for you guys uh i'm trying to record 20 videos and i know you want to see two more tokens today uh that i gotta talk about and it's very late i've been recording for 13 14 hours now um the board api club is getting it's all film trilogy with crypto exchange coinbase behind the camera the films are just latest boost in what has been a stellar six what I want to say was I didn't want to complain or anything. I'm doing my part in this dump to support the community, to uh, to bring you up to date with the news. You can subscribe if you want to see more content just like this. Hit the like button if you want to support the channel. really, really helps out. The first of the three stunts for the series of animated short films titled The Dayton Trilogy will premiere at NFT.New York City in June, which is very, very soon. Uh, I want my NFT TV. It's going to be big, by the way. I'll probably talk about it more tomorrow. But this is very big. This is massive news for anyone that's holding any ape coin.
Uh, I don't know, it's not getting that much recognition. It should get a lot more recognition. Something interesting uh, is that March 2022 saw over 20 Bitcoin ATM installations daily globally. Since most of the wells are holding ApeCoin, chances are if we get new wells, they'll hold ApeCoin as well. They'll diversify their portfolio with it. Not to mention, we had the uh, these Barclay Bank traders that got 70 bored apes. So uh, a lot of big money is actually coming into ApeCoin, which is weird. Not Doge, not Shiba Inu. ApeCoin, that's really good. As you go, crypto adoption is on high crypto industries are putting uh, up Bitcoin ATMs to easy transaction accessibilities. And also, let's say it like it is. To avoid taxes, data provided by Coin ATM Radio shows that there are currently 36k crypto ATMs worldwide. You can see the huge spike, especially since the uh, last bull run, 20 uh, in the COVID started in 2021. Had uh, the biggest spikes of the the bull run. We had this uh, this massive spike up. Uh, the bad thing is NFT ATM. That's weird. By colors by pigeons the the one thing i do not like is that they are actually sometimes charging you 10 percent to buy 10 percent to sell so if you just buy and sell for 100 bucks you'll be left with 80. Uh, that's something i'm not happy about hopefully that's something they fix um yeah the entire motto of the atm was to make crypto and nfts accessible to everyone that's something we need that's a cool thing. They'll also be profitable, I guess, if they uh, use the right locations. Uh, we'll talk about Fortnite tomorrow because that's a very big topic on its own uh, that I wanted to cover. But is crypto the heaven of corrupt countries? The um, monet monetary fund says so. Look, it is. But Russia doesn't use crypto that much. So, <laughs> you demand player. Uh, allegedly. Allegedly. This is for entertainment purpose only. Crypto has managed to fend off an array of associations from the dark web to money laundering. Cryptocurrency were viewed as assets that were instruments to carry out illicit activity. But look, this was 2013 with Silk Road in 2012. This is not 2022. You have Elon Musk, you have Tesla. Uh, the monetary fund study finds this cryptocurrency is most commonly used in countries with high corruption inflation no i, I would i would argue the, the the difference i would bet that the most the most of the people the, the most, highest volume of crypto is done in the united states come on man jack muller is the founder of the world of strike with the lightning network that's really good allows people to send money across borders instantly for pennies so yeah uh he talk with the Salvadorian government about the metrics of cryptocurrencies uh, and Bitcoin. Yeah, this, he was a revolutionary. There were some issues. There were some drama around uh, one of the shops that was had to accept crypto with him. Uh, I, I don't want to be negative, you know. So uh, we went the video here. This is uh, this was uh, everything that I think you should know about Bitcoin to be brought up to date. Uh, if you appreciate it, slap the like button. Um, I'm doing everything for you guys. I'm staying up so late just for you guys. I'm here to serve you. All you guys do is subscribe if you want to learn about all the hottest cryptocurrencies first before you learn about them in any other place. And I want to see you next one. This is Vietnam Financial Advice. Bye.